folks. My name is Teacher Chad. This hour, uh, uh, hi guys, welcome to class. I thought, I thought it had already started. Uh, welcome to class. It's good to have you here. Um, uh, we this hour we're going to be uh, practicing our reading and pronunciation as we read through a uh, a short story. Uh, this uh, this class is intended for advanced readers. The uh, link to the story is in the class materials section. Uh, if you cannot find it, I'm placing it in the Verbling and the Google chat boxes right now. There we go. Okay, so uh, let's see who we have in class so far. Hi there, Sompoy. How are you? I'm doing good, teacher. How are you? Excellent. I'm doing great. Thank you. Nice to have you here. Yes, teacher. Okay. How about Jorge? Hi there, Jorge. How are you? Hi, Chad. How are you? I'm doing well. Excellent, excellent. Good to have you here. Um, let's see here. Heidi. Hi there, Heidi. Welcome to class. Hello. Uh, nice to see you again. Nice to see you as well. And we also have Amparo. Hi there, Amparo. Good to have you back in class. Okay, probably waiting for the microphone. Uh, okay, you guys. There you are. There you are. Good to have you. Okay, um, so the story we're going to be reading today is entitled I Invisible Girl. Okay, uh, let me go ahead and... Oh, let's see here. All right, let me go ahead and uh, share my, my screen with you. And we're going to start off with Sompoy over on the right-hand side. All right. Okay. Okay, Sompoy, let me have you uh, start off by reading uh, the first paragraph. Go ahead and read that in about half of this next one, uh, reading down to uh, here where it says, Minnesota to find out, please. Okay. Invisible Girl. A short story by Barbara Mullin. Under a fragile April sun, five foot heaps of snow had begun to crush and melt alongside the roads and sidewalks and trickle down gutters towered the lake. Molly was frankly sick of the extra long frigid 1940 winter. Anyway, and finally even bore with ice skating after school every day. That morning, she took extra time on her walk to school, enjoying long breaths of the slightly warmer air that for the first time since November didn't turn the snow under her knitted face calf to ice. This first promise of spring had cast a genuine spell over her, causing her attention to drift over to the windows of her third grade classroom all morning. What lies beyond this Oak Street school, she wondered. If I were a beautiful Canadian goose, I would flap my widespread wings and fly far, far away from Winnetouba, Minnesota, to find out. Okay, nice job. Uh, let's take a look here at a long I sound. <clears throat> okay, so this word is I, fi, find, find, find Fine. out. Find out. Okay, one more time. Fi, find out. Find out. Good. Uh, next up is uh, the word wondered. Make sure to pronounce the ed at the end. Wondered. Wondered. Okay. Now uh, here you're stopping right here at the r. Okay, saying wonder. wonder. Okay, let's add the d at the end. Wondered. Wondered. Okay, almost. Okay, uh, make sure that d sounds. Wondered. Wondered. There you go. That's it. Okay, good. Let's go to uh, let's go to the word her. Okay, instead of huh. Okay, curve your tongue up to pronounce the r. Her. Uh, 
Hello, some boy? All right, do we, oh, she's back in now. She's back. Hi, some boy, can you hear me okay? Yes, yes. There her. we go. Hi. Okay, let's try, let's try the word her, okay? So her. make sure to curve your tongue up. There you go. Her. Her. Good, good. Much better. Much better. Uh, next up is uh, the word genuine, right here. Genuine. The I is a short I sound. Genuine. Okay, one Gen more time. Genu. Genuine. Genuine. Okay, very good. Um, next up, we have slightly. Slightly. Try that. Slightly. Good. Slightly. That was really good. That was awesome. Okay. Uh, let's try the uh, long I sound with the word time. So instead of Tom, it's tai, time. Time. Uh huh. Good. One more time. 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 Good. Nice job. Okay. Uh, next up is um, gutters. Right here. You can say gutters and pronounce those T's or switch the T to a, a flap T sound. So this is gutters. Gutter. Okay. Make sure to pronounce the S at the end. Gutters. Gutters. Okay. Very good. Um, and let's go to the word April. Okay. A P R L. Okay. So it's April. 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 Uh -huh, April. One more time. April. April. Good. Good. All right. Nice job. Thank you. Okay. Okay. So let's go to uh, Jorge. Okay. And Jorge, please read from um, In All Her Seven Years. Finish this paragraph. Uh, read this next one. And uh, also read down to here where it says uh, Into Her Birthday Cake. Okay. In all her seven years, she'd never stepped a foot outside her little town. Her friends had bragged about trips they'd taken with their parents. Patsy to Minneapolis. Patsy to Minneapolis, Jenny to Detroit. But what's the use of comparing myself to my friends who come from normal families? She decided once more. To Molly's way of thinking, a normal family had a maximum of three children making her own family with its noise. Raucous, six kids, embarrassingly abnormal. Older brother Michael and twin sister Margaret and Mary had come along first, Molly next, and then before she was two brothers, Johnny, and three years after that, Dennis. All gifts from God, their mother promised them. I want to be only child. Molly had screamed loudly on her fourth birthday when baby brother Denise Stubble had first into her birthday cake. Okay, very good. Let's uh, let's practice a challenging word here. So this is birth. Okay, instead of beer, birth, uh, sorry, birthday. Okay, it's bur, birthday, birthday, birthday. There you go. Good. One more time. Birthday. Birthday. Good. Okay. Next up is toppled. Ed ending here. Toppled. Toppled. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Uh, next up we have screamed instead of screamed. Okay. The ed ending sounds like this. Screamed. Uh, screamed. Mm -hmm. Very good. Now, uh, here you left out uh, uh, two and an. Okay, so this is, I want to be an only child. I want to be an only child. I want to be an only child. Okay, one more time. I want to be an only child. I want to be an only child. Okay, very good. Uh, next word is promised. Instead of promised, it's promised. Promised. OK, 
Okay, very good. Uh, next up is embarrassingly. 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 Okay, one more time. <laughs> Embarrass. Embarrassingly. Embarrassingly. Okay, nice job. Uh, next up is noisy. Noi. Noisy. Noisy. Okay, very good. Um, next is, let's see here, uh, the word own instead of on. Okay, this is o, own. Own. Mm -hmm. Very good. Um, next, we have, okay, so we have ed endings here. So this is bragged. Instead of bragged, it's bragged. Bragged. Mm -hmm. One more time. Bragged. Bragged. Okay, good. And the last word is foot. Instead of foo, foot, it's an u uh sound. Fu, foot. Foot. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. Let's go to Heidi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Heidi, let me have you read from uh, That Was the Day. Okay, mm -hmm. finish this paragraph. And read most of this second paragraph down to uh, down to here where it says uh, to tease her and call her names, please. Okay, that was the day she began to fantasize about the mother and the father God ought to have given her. Her dream mother would have been uh, serene and uh, loving. Her Im uh, imagined father understanding and caring and he'd, uh, he'd have lost the very taste of whiskey on his tongue. In her real life family home, Molly spent a lot of time reading in the upstairs bedroom she shared with her teenage twin sisters, Margaret and Mary, who for the most part overlooked her extent but whenever she tried to enter the, uh, their conversations, they scolded at, at her, turned away, and began to whisper secrets to one another and at the other end of their dormitory-sized room. The boys, Michael and Johnny, and even little Dennis, were tied as a gang of no-good thugs. When they noticed her, at the all it was to tease her and call her names day in day out her mother could okay just still there mm -hmm. all right just tell there very good thank you very much okay let's uh, let's take a look uh, first up we have the word little okay so g give me a good L at the beginning and a good L at the end little li little. little little there you go very good. So let's try this. So it's uh, even little Dennis. Even little Dennis. Even little Dennis. Okay, very good. Um, next word is right here. The word is pronounced scowled. 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 Okay, so you're almost there. So make sure to lift your tongue up and touch the top of your mouth with the uh, for the L. Okay. Scowl, scowl. Scowled. There you go. One more time. Scowled. Scowled. Okay, very good. Uh, next is the word, um, okay, so here, there it is. So, on his tongue. So, here you added an extra sound after his, saying, uh, on his a tongue. Okay, so on, focus on that S and the T. On his tongue. On his tongue. On Good, his one tongue. more time. There you go. Good. Okay, this word here is pronounced loathed. 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 Lo loathed. Okay, very nice. Very nice. And uh, one last uh, part for you is here. Okay, now instead of good, good ot. It's God ought. God ought to have given her. God
God ought to had to have given her. God ought to have given her. Uh, one more time. God, God, God. Uh, ought. So both of those, the O uh -huh. uh, in God and then the O-U-G-H, that's an ah uh sound as well. God ought to have given her. God ought to have given her. Good, good. Nice job. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's continue here. Um, Amparo, please read from uh, day in and day in, day out. Okay, finish this paragraph and read down to uh, notice my absence, please. Day in, day out, her mother could clean the nugget the girls to finish their their chores and issued orders they simply ignored. Emily never fooled herself about how things were. Abruptly wakening Molly from her daydream, Miss Fisher instructed uh, the class to study their multiplication tables for 15 minutes. Um, since Molly knew the tables backwards and forwards, she used the time instead to make after-school plans for herself. This is a perfect day for, for a nice long walk somewhere, she decided. Mom is substitute uh, teaching today and won't be home till 5 o'clock. Mary and Margaret will invite friends over to our unwatched house to raise hell in the upstairs bedroom. And <laughs> the gangsters, as usual, won't even notice me. Okay, very good. Let's take a look here. Uh, first up, okay, this is going to be gay, gangsters, instead of gang, okay? Uh, so close the mouth just a little bit more, and it's an A. So gay, gangsters. Mm -hmm. Okay, try that word, please. Gangsters. Gang. There you go. Gangster. Okay. Very good. Let's go to the next word. This is somewhere. So make sure to pronounce the M instead of somewhere. It's mm -hmm. some, some, somewhere. Somewhere. Okay. Now, after the M, you want to go to the mm -hmm. U sound. Some, somewhere. Somewhere. There you go. One more time. Somewhere. Somewhere. Good, good. Okay. Uh, next up, we have. Uh, whoops. Okay. Uh, the word chores instead of shores. Give me a good ch sound. Chores. Chore. Okay, with an s at the end. Chores. Chores. All right, very good. And the last one is uh, the ed ending here. Okay, the <laughs> word is pronounced nagged. 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 Mm -hmm. One more time. Nagged. Nagged. Good, good. That's it. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, no problem. Uh, let's go to Walla. Hi, Walla. How are you? Fine, thanks. What about you? I'm doing great. Thank you. Uh, okay, Walla, let me have you read from Molly Smiled. Okay, finish this paragraph, and let me have you read down to here where it says, God himself were cheering her on, please. Okay. Molly smiled behind her multiplication, multi, multiplication sheet and glanced back at the classroom windows, uh, windows where the sun still shone brightly. With lunch over and the math test snitched, Molly kept her eye on the third degree, uh, grade clock as it crept toward the three o'clock. As the principal's office fell shrieked out its uh, declaration of freedom, Molly shot, Molly shot, uh, Molly shot up from her desk and ran, ran toward the exit door. Once outside, she glanced down Oak Street, f first in the direction of home and then the other way toward. Well, she didn't know, but her uh, but her galoshes, like uh, 
like they had minds of their own, swirled around on the slushy sidewalk and headed toward the, uh, the place of uh, mystery. Spring sunshine warmed her face and Nick, uh, and Nick as if God himself were cheering her on. Okay, nice job. Okay, very good. Uh, let's take a look here. First up, we have the word neck. Now, this is going to be a short E sound instead of nick. Okay, with a A E sound, it's E, ne, neck. Neck. Good, good. Nice job. Um, next up is, uh, okay, so this uh, this is a new one for you. Uh, this is galoshes. Galoshes. Her galoshes. What what does galoshes mean? Uh, galoshes are boots. Okay, rain oh, okay. boots that you wear. Yeah, mm -hmm. so it's to, it's to keep your feet uh, from getting wet. Okay. All right. Um, next up, we have uh, shrieked right here. So instead of shrieked, okay, long e shrieked. sound. Shree, shrieked. Shrieked. Okay, very good. And the last word for you. Um, is it's actually a combination so it's where whoops where'd you go okay right here uh, where the sun still okay so um, we could say windows where the sun so what we're focusing on is that R and where leading up to the TH here you said where the sun and you rolled a little bit so let's try that again so windows where the sun try that windows where the sun Windows where the sun. Okay, one more time. So instead of where, where the sun, it's where. Uh, where. Push your tongue down for that R. Where okay. the sun. Windows where the sun. Okay, all right, very close. So let's try just the word where by itself. Where. Where. Okay, now let's add the. Where the. Where the sun. There you go, that's it. Windows where the sun. Windows where the sun. That's it. Good. Nice job. Nice job. Good work. Okay. Let's go to um, negative creep. Yeah, I'm right here. Hello. Hi. Uh, what's Hi. your name? Uh, my name is Milena. Hi. It's, it's like this. Yeah. Hi to you too. Milena. Uh-huh. Hi. And Milena, where are you from? I'm from Russia. From Russia, okay. Uh -huh. And are you are you a negative creep? <laughs> yeah, probably in some ways. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Well, it's a, it's a, it's it's sort of strange, but if you are a negative creep, all right, you can you can call yourself that. But uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> it's, it's actually a Nirvana <laughs> song, you know. <laughs> that oh, a Nirvana song. Yeah, okay. Nirvana. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, so Nirvana Nirvana was kind of creepy, so that makes sense. <laughs> oh my god, okay. <laughs> no, they're, they're, a, they're, a, they're a very popular band, but if you take a look at his lyrics, okay, mm -hmm. he, was, he, was not a very, he was not a very positive person. Okay? Yeah. And he also shot himself in the head with a shotgun. Okay. I know so, that story pretty well. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. So uh, me as well. So that's that's why that's why I say he's kind of creepy because his lyrics, mm -hmm. um, his lyrics were all about that as well because he just wasn't a very happy person. Mm -hmm. But okay, so let me have you let me have you continue here from mm -hmm. uh, she hummed. Okay. Uh, finish this paragraph. Uh, read this one and come down to here where it says into Lake Superior, please. She hummed, yeah. She. Oh, oh my god. Just hold on a second. Uh huh. Okay, I see it. And to Lake Superior. Uh huh. So she hummed a favorite song and then started to sing the words. Um, you're my favorite. Sh oh, oh my god, sorry. Uh, you're my sunshine, my only sunshine, for a few blocks. Four or five blocks further on, she noticed where uh, were larger and larger spaces between the two stories shingled houses. Next, she realized that Oak Street had gotten uh, wider 
and in fact had sprouted a whole new passing lane down the center. At the side of the road she noticed a tall black and white sign that read Minnesota Highway uh, 34, 10 miles to Big Bay. Wow, Big Bay! Molly held out loud uh, while guessing that 10 miles wasn't that far. I bet if I make a dash for it, I can be there in no time, she thought. While speeding up her gate, uh, she recalled the morning Miss Fisher has shown their class gorgeous pictures of clear fresh water, big bay that uh, emptied into Lake Superior. All right, nice job, really good job. Okay, uh, nice thank pronunciations. You, <laughs> yeah, my intonation is kind of broken though, I'm so sorry. <laughs> No, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, there was a uh, your intonation, in fact, was was uh, was okay. Okay. Uh, there was only one part where where I really noticed where you went up on the wrong part and down on the wrong part. Yeah. Um, and so that was right here. So uh, I can be there in no time. Okay. So instead of saying in no time and coming up on time and down on no, we want to say in no time. So up on no, down on time. Uh -huh. I can be there in no time. I can be there in no time. Yep, just like that. Okay, mm -hmm. just like just like regular statements. Now, yes, uh, most of your your sentences your sentences were just fine. Okay, uh, and how you were speaking. Yeah, just just remember as well is that mm -hmm. um, native English speakers we make mm -hmm. mistakes as well. Okay? <laughs> okay, so yeah, we don't read perfectly. Um, sometimes we misspeak and things like that. So, yeah, your 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 uh, your pronunciations were pretty good. I do want to practice a a set of words right here, and this mm -hmm. is the last practice for you. So, um, oops, I want to do from here. So it's, this is going to be the two-story shingled houses. Okay, let's try this. The two-story uh -huh. shingled houses. The two-story shingled houses. The two-story shingled good. houses. Mm -hmm. There you go. One more time. The two-story shingled houses. The two-story shingled houses. Good. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's that's great. Yeah, the first time you came through there, you added an uh, an uh, s on the end of story, leading that into shingled. So it was just a little bit off. Yeah, and it, you've got uh -huh. the s's and the sh there. But yeah, yeah, everything okay. else so it was really good. It was really good. Thank nice you job. Very much. Nice job. <laughs> mm -hmm, no problem. Um, let's uh, continue here with. Uh, let's see, some uh, some boy. Yes, teacher. Please continue from uh, with no houses, okay? And finish this paragraph here, please. Okay. With no houses inside now, she could see ahead to where the sun was now sinking lower in the sky. Sunshine glinted off a a tin roof on one lonely farmhouse on the horizon. Scattered patches of unmelted snow still clung to the east side of the three-lane highway, highway where tiny springs of growth had started to shout up out of the brown damp earth. Every few minutes a single car whizzed by in either direction. On Molly's side of the highway, steep rock, rocky hills left almost no walking path. No question, Molly decided it would be easier to walking along the flat lane on the other side than dodging rocks on her side. Okay. All right. Very good. So let's uh, let's take a look here at the word dodging right here. Dodge. Instead of dotting, it's dodge. The DG makes the J sound. Dodging. Dodging. Okay. One more time. Do dodging. Dodging. Okay. Very good. Let's practice the TH sound. So um, here you said on the other, on the other side. Okay, so give me a good TH. Make sure your tongue is placed between your teeth. On the other <coughs> side. On the other side. Uh, should I say on the other side? Okay, so here you're saying other. On the other side. Oh, okay. On, okay, so you want to say the other. Tongue between the teeth. 
on the other side. On the other side. Okay, one more time. So you're saying D. So place your tongue between your teeth. I want you to say th the. The. On the other side. There you go. That's it. Okay, those are the TH sounds. Okay. Uh, next up, we have the word question instead of que. Question. It's que. Short E sound. Question. Question. Okay, good. Uh, let's go to a single car. So we have the L sound here. And remember, curve your tongue up for the R sound. Single car. A single car. Yes, very good. That was great. Um, next up is um, the number three. Okay, so tongue between the teeth. Okay, into the R E E. So it's thir, three, three. Uh, three. Okay, one more time. You're saying three. Okay, rolling the R. Push the tongue down for the R. So it's thir, three. Three. Okay, three. almost. Almost. Okay, so uh, make sure your tongue is between your teeth. Okay, that's how you're going to get the th sound. Thir, three. 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 Okay. Three. All right, now this will this will be a good word for you to practice. Okay, so I would write that one down and see if uh, on YouTube or something like that you can uh, look up how people say that. Look closely at their mouth and try and mimic that in, in, okay. in your tongue placement. Okay. Okay. Uh, this word here is pronounced horizon. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. Nice job. And um, the last word for you is. Farmhouse. Okay, give me a good R here. Curve the tongue up. Farmhouse. Farmhouse. Mm -hmm. One more time. Farmhouse. Farms. Um, farmhouse. All right, good, good. Nice job. Thank you. Okay, good. Let's go to Jorge. Okay. All right, Jorge, let me have you uh, read this next pa uh, paragraph from looking one way down to into the same lane, please. Okay. Looking the one way, the other, up and down the three-lane highway. She has parked online only one car in the distance heading, is back, a heading back toward town. Run right now, she is crushed at herself. Her legs race across the first lane then the middle lane, then into the far lane. Suddenly, from the corner of her eye, she spied the vehicle that had seemed so far away only a moment ago coming up on her. Without a second to spare, she leaped backward into the middle lane, but at the same moment, the car, trying to avoid her, swerved into the same lane. Okay, very good. Uh, let's go to... Uh, let's see here. Okay, without a second to spare. Without a second to spare. Without a second to spare. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, next up is, um, okay, she spied the vehicle. So, focusing on the SH here, the SP, so we don't want to say S spied, okay, and then the V sound, okay, so she spied the vehicle. She spied the vehicle. There you go. One more time. She spied the vehicle. She spied the vehicle. Good, good. Next up, we have the word raced. Make sure to pronounce that T sound at the end. Raced. Raced. Okay, good. And last word for you. This word is distance. 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 There you go. One more time. Distance. Distance. Good, good. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Heidi, you're up next. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Please uh, read this next paragraph from Molly Felt Full, the Full, uh, down to I'm getting my car, please. Okay. Molly felt the full blast of uh, the impact. Then the jolt and the swift thrust, uh, thrust of her body through the air. Uh, she had the uh, thud, thud when uh, she collided with the hard earth 
at once um, blackness swirled. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> at once blackness swirled around her and then closed in on her. She didn't know how much later, but through the darkness, she felt the touch of unknown hands on her cheeks. Then he heard a woman scream, Wake up, wake up, please don't fade away. Oh Christ, the blood. Oh, where did you come from? How will I get you from the highway uh, through the field to my car? Jesus, girl, don't die uh, while I, uh, I'm gone. Uh, okay, I've gone. I'm getting my car. I'll, I'll go. I'm okay. sorry. <laughs> my uh, letter yeah. changed because <laughs> uh, my, I have Japanese uh, PC, so. <laughs> okay, did it, did it start translating it? Yeah. And not, uh, okay. Um, uh, apostrophe to change to Japanese letters. Ah, <laughs> so. uh, yes, yes. Okay, no worries, no worries. Okay, let's uh, let's take a look here. So, <clears throat> let's go to the word woman first. Okay, now here you said wu woman. Okay, instead of woman, it's going to be wu woman. Try that. Woman. Okay, one more time. Wu with an u uh sound. Woman. 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 Okay. Now uh, here you're starting off and you're saying woman. Instead of woman, it's u. W, w, woman. 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 There you go. That's it. One more time. Woman. Woman. Good. Good. Okay. Uh, next up is okay. The word closed. Okay. So here uh, we're looking at the C L. Now here you're saying closed. All right. And now the position of your tongue is in, is important here. Okay. Because you're pronouncing that L sort of like a hard R sound, saying closed. All right. Now, it's true, your tongue needs to touch the top of your mouth, but you need to push your tongue forward in your mouth. Okay. So right now, you're saying crossed, and your tongue is hitting here. You need to curve it down and push it towards the front of your mouth like that. Cl closed. closed. There you go. One more time. Closed. closed. Cool. All right. Uh, let's take a look here. Uh, our next word is swirled. Okay, instead of swirled, okay, it's an er sound. Swir, swirled. Swirled. Mhm. Mm there you go. Uh, next up is swift thrust. Okay, right here, swift thrust. Swift blast. Okay, swift one more time. Swift blast. Okay, so what you're going to do, this T, we don't want to finish that down. I got it. We're going to combine these sounds, okay? So this is swift thrust. Swift thrust. Okay, all right, better, better. All right, and the last word for you is the word full. Instead of foo, fool, it's f, full. Full. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. All right, let's go to... Uh, Kako, how you doing, Kako? Hi, teacher. How are things? Okay. Okay, Molly. very good. All right, let me have you read from Molly Heard down to Blackness Would Return, please. Okay, teacher. Molly heard it all, then nothing. nothing until she sensed herself being tugged at, at, at and lift, lifted. Soon after that, she felt the motion of car wheels under her. Forcing an eye, forcing an eye open and gazing through a gray, through a gray haze, she recognized her her own body is spread across the back seat of a car. Next, she caught a glimpse of her right leg below her knee. 
almost detached, it dangled at a strange right angle while spurting blood spurting blood up onto the car upholstery and falling onto the floor. She moved her hand to her right side where the pain was the worst and saw that the corner of a Minnesota license plate was pasted to her hip, her hip, hip, to her hip. She looked away, shut her eyes, and, and wished that the total blackness would return. All right, nice job. Uh, the best part is, is that I'm going to eat dinner right after this story. So this part right here makes me, <laughs> I was like, oh, gross. Okay, nice nice job, Kako. Let's, uh, let's take a look at uh, some words here. First up, we have the word wished. Instead of, a, instead of using a long E saying we, wished, it's we, wished, short I. Wished. There you go. Okay, good. Let's go to <clears throat> where the pain. Now, give me a good TH sound here. Instead of where the where the pain, it's where the where the pain. Where the pain. <laughs> where the pain. Very good. Uh, next, we have the word while. Okay, right here. Give me a good L here at the end. While. While. Mm -hmm. Good. Curve the tongue up. Touch the top of the mouth. While. While. Good. That's it. Good. Uh, next up is detached. Okay. All of your ED endings were, were pretty good. This is the only one that was off a little bit. Okay. So give me a T sound here. Detached. Detached. Okay. One more time. Detached. Detached. Good. Good. Okay. And uh, the last one. Uh, is after that. Okay, so here we have the TH as well. So instead of after that, okay, give me a good TH. After that. The, that. After, after that. After that. After okay. that. Good, good. All right, nice job. Nice job. Thank you. Teacher. Uh, yes. Uh, wish, wished that. Wished that. Uh -huh. Wish, wish that. So use a short I there instead of we, wish that. Okay, you are going to combine that T with the TH. Okay, so it's wish that. Wish that, wish that. Mm -hmm. wish yeah, that. so it, when, you're, when you're talking about combining, when you're talking about combining words and whatnot in, uh, in American English, okay, a T sound will combine with a TH. Wish that. Wish that. Wish Just that. like that. Uh huh. That's good. Okay, nice job. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. All right, no problem. Let's go to Amparo. All right, Amparo, let me have you read from Molly Open Her Eyes. Okay, finish this paragraph. And let me have you read down to, um, let's see here. That's a long one. Yeah, go ahead and, and finish that off. So down to uh, two more swinging doors, please. Holly opened her eyes again when her shrieked to a top uh, to stop, and from the car window she saw a hospital emergency room sign. Her driver swung open a car door and screamed, "Help! Help!" An injured girl in the back, back seat, she may be bleeding to death. In the dark, she had imagined her driver to be an older woman, but now so that she looked only 20 or so. Or so. Brave for, for someone so young, Molly thought, while feeling disconnected uh, from the real activity swirling ab uh, about her, Three men in blue jacket, uh, jacket removed her from the car, laid her on, on a rolling cot 
place the almost uh, detached sections of right lead carefully on the pillow. One of the blue jacket men slapped the two hands down on one end uh, of the cot, uh, shoved, shoved it through the emergency entrance and pushed it rapidly down the corridor and through two more swimming doors. Okay, nice job. Nice job. Let's take a look here. Uh, first up is shoved it through. Okay, so uh, this was pretty good. I, I do want to practice that one more time, uh, but then also the THR. Okay, so uh, this is shoved, so shoved it through. Try that. Shoved it through. Okay, one more time. Shoved it. Shoved it through. Shoved it through. Okay, very good. Uh, next up is the number three. Okay, right here. So, thir, three men. Try that. Three. Three, three men. Mm -hmm. One more time. Three men. Three men. Good, good. Much better with that THR. That sounded really good. Um, and the last one for you is here. She looked. She looked only 20 or so. She looked only 20 or so. Mm -hmm. One more time. She looked only 20 or so. She looked only 20 or so. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Good job. Thank you. Thanks. All right. Let's go to um, Milena. All right. Milena, let me have you read from uh, Two Men. I'm okay, sorry. Some connection problems. Uh -huh, okay. Uh, two Men. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so from Two Men. Um, uh, finish this paragraph, read these uh, couple lines, and let me have you read down to here where it says, she saw that it was nighttime, please. She saw that, uh-huh, okay, I got it. Um, two men in what looked to be doctor's white coats lifted her onto a high tab table. Under bright round ceiling lights, uh, Molly's eyes tried to follow them as they and three or four nurses dashed about her. One of the doctors stuck a rubbery mask over her, her face and told the nurse, I'm turning on the, the ether, or ether, I'm not sure now. Tell her to count backwards from 50 if she can. And just before passing out, Molly heard one of the doctors ask the, the other, Any chance we can save the leg? The next voice Molly, Molly heard was uh, her mother's asking, how long has she been out? Several hours, a man answered. Molly struggled to raise her eyelids just enough to see she was in a big comfy bed of a green room with flower pictures on the wall. Through a large square window, she saw uh, that it, it was night time. Yeah. All right, nice job, okay. nice job. Mm -hmm. Okay, Thank yeah, you. your intonation was uh, was pretty good. Uh, let's take a look mm -hmm. at uh, some words. Now, uh, this is a gas. It's pronounced ether, ether. Ether. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, so it it puts you out. It puts you under. Okay, so they mm -hmm. do surgery on you. Okay, let's uh, let's try for this uh, this R Y sound here in the middle. So this is a rubbery mask. A rubbery mask. A rubbery mask. Uh huh. Okay, give me a good E sound instead of rubbery. Okay, so you're saying rubbery. Instead of rubbery, it's rubbery. A rubbery, rubbery. mask. Rubbery mask. That's it. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. And the last thing for you, okay, mm -hmm. is under, uh, under bright round ceiling lights. Okay, so focusing on uh, the er sound here into the br. And then I just wanted to practice the rest of the, uh -huh. uh, the phrase. So under, under bright round ceiling lights. Under bright round ceiling lights. That's it. Okay, really good. Okay, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. Mm -hmm. um, next up is uh, some boy. Okay, some boy. Let me have you continue from uh, her gaze wandered. Okay, finish this paragraph and read down to forehead. Okay, she kissed Molly on the forehead, please. So, boy, are you there? 
Oh, okay, yeah, let's I'm go here. to. Oh, you are? Okay, go ahead and read that, please. Her, her gaze wandered back to her own bed, where the blankets on her right side were draped over a foot high tunnel shaped object. Is my leg under there? She cried out. Oh my god, she's awake, doctor. Her mother bonded across the room and bent over Molly. I'm here, honey, she said. They called me. I came right away. She kissed Molly on the forehead. Okay, very good. Let's uh, let's go to the word forehead instead of forehead. When you say fa, your tongue is pointed down. With your tongue, you want to point it uh, or curve it upwards for the R. Forehead. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. That's it. Okay. Next up, we have the word kissed. Short I sound instead of key. Kissed. It's kissed. Kissed. Mm -hmm. Good. Um, this word here is pronounced bow. Bound. Bounded. 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 Okay. So you're missing the N here. You're saying bounded. It's bow. Mm, did bounded bow bounded that's it one more time bounded bounded good good uh, next we have the word mother okay instead of mother okay give me a good th here moth mother 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 okay place your tongue between your teeth mother Moth. mother mother, mother. Mother. Okay. All right. So the T, the T H. This is a this is a good one for you to practice as well. That yes, T H sound. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, um, I might do. We'll see, we'll see when I can fit it in. But I uh, but I uh, I'd like to do a T H uh, T H pronunciation class and really focus on it a bit more. Okay. Um, next word. Uh, this is draped instead of dropped. It's draped. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. And your last word is wa wandered. Wandered. Wander. Okay, give me an ah sound. Wander. Wa. 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 Wander. Okay, now uh, you're ending right here saying wander. Okay, you need the wander. D sound at the very end. Wandered. Wandered. There you go, that's it. Good. All right, nice job, some point. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's go to Jorge. Okay. Okay, Jorge, please read from I'm So Sorry. Uh, finish this paragraph, read this line here, and I'll have you read down to uh, her eyelids closing again, please. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. Oh. Uh, oh, I can see very well. I, I'm sorry. Oh, okay, yeah. I'm sorry. They are taking good care of you. Are you in terrible pain? Molly points to the heel under the blank. Mom, is my leg still on me? They pinned the separate bones together and covered the leg with a cast. They hope it will grow back together. We have a lot of praying to do now. To do now. Okay, Molly, say her a light, I light, closing again. Okay, very good. All right, couple things here. First up, we have again. This is going to be a short I sound instead of a gay again with a long a. Use a short I again. Again. Mm -hmm. Very good. This word here is pronounced. Eyelids, eyelids, eyelids. Mm -hmm. One more time, eyelids, eyelids. Okay, very good. Next up, we have the word said. Okay, short e sound. Se, said, said. Good, nice job. Good vowel sound. Um, next up is hope instead of hop. This is ho, hope. Hope. Mm -hmm. Very good. 
Very good. Um, instead of, uh, in this word here, instead of cased, it's ca, cast, cast, cast. Mm -hmm, very good. And this word here is pronounced pinned, pinned, instead of pinned, pinned. Pinned. There you go. Good. And our last word for you is terrible. Instead of ter, terrible, it's tear, terrible. Terrible. Okay, good. One more time. Ter. She used a short I. Terrible. Terrible. Okay, one more time. So you're saying terry. Instead of terrible, it's ter, terrible. Terrible. There you go. Good. Much better with the vowel sound. Okay. All right, you guys. Well, thank you. Thank you for coming into class. It was great having you here. Uh, I'm going to take a break. Uh, I don't have any classes tonight, um, uh, but uh, I will be back uh, tomorrow. Uh, I believe I'm teaching a bunch of classes tomorrow. I think I have seven or so. So starting in the morning, uh, some afternoon classes as well as some nighttime classes. Okay? So tomorrow is really jam-packed. All right, you guys. Thank, Thank you for you. coming. We'll see you. Bye. Okay. Bye. Thank Bye. you, teacher. Bye, guys.